welcome back dear friends in our last two classes we have discussed about array how we can create array in two different ways so inside this class i'm just going to use here just one more comment section uh, yes let's just put one more comment section here because we are going to start a new section from here so we are going to discuss about i'm just going to tell you here uh, about this card length and concat you can say just method c o n c a t concat method or properties properties so here first i'm just going to create a variable by the name of uh, we can create uh, by any name i'm just creating you can say bias is equal to new array then inside this round bracket i'm going to pass out some names here for example uh, just four is enough so inside the first one i'm just writing here so let's just change the bias to anything else for example we can say color so inside color i'm just writing here blue color inside this i'm just writing red color then we have green color then we have yellow color so we have just some uh, attributes here inside these quotations so here you can just come here document dot write function you can use this one inside this we are going to call the name of our variable color dot length so this is the first property that we have used here now come here and refresh so you can see we have got four and why for you can just count this one number one number two number three number four because we have four pro uh, attribute inside this one if you are going to add one more here so you can say purple save this now come here and you can see the length is five if you are increasing or decreasing the value so it will give you the exact result for example this time i'm just writing here black one more we are going to insert here and this can be white color you can just save this now come here and refresh so we have c1 so it will count the number of uh, the values or you can see attribute inside these quotations so it is number c1 you can see number one number two number three four five six seven so this was a length property if you are using inside this creation so it, this will called property uh, so let me just create another variable here for example variable this time we are going to say the things for example things is equal to new array then we have this to round bracket inside this we are going to pass out some value just three is enough for four so i'm just writing here a bike so here we can just say camera C A M and here we can say car and we here we can just say uh, just uh, computer now we have two variables one for color one for things so I want to just to concat these two variables together so one more variable variable both is equal to I'm just saying color dot concat you can see then you can use this to round bracket inside this one you are writing the name of your second variable which is things so we can just save this and inside this one you need to call the variable both now we can just save this and refresh so you can see we have first blue green red yellow the colors then i'm going to zoom out then you have the things like bike camera because we have inserted the color at first color then concat so you can just use here the things if you want to display this first and the color here you can just simply replace this i can save and refresh now this time we have bike here camera car computer then we have the list of colors so here also you can just use the index number for example on the index number five from here uh, from the things zero one two three four five and number five we have i think red color so you can say we have red color so on the number three we have computer so if you are using here three so we will get the computer here 
so it is working just very simple uh, it was about in, inside this class we have discussed about length and concrete uh, method or properties you can see so I hope you are understand how we can create method and properties inside array so thank you for watching this video and see you in the next class